Hey what's up guys, today we're going to be reviewing the Nufi Halo 65 HE. This is a 65% Hall Effect keyboard from Nufi. If you guys remember, earlier on my channel I reviewed the Nufi Air 60 HE and I really liked that keyboard. It was a low profile Hall Effect, the world's first ever low profile Hall Effect keyboard and I highly recommend that keyboard if you guys are looking for a low profile Hall Effect. Extremely well built and priced very fairly as well. So I'll leave that a link to that review in the description below if you want to check it out. But if you guys aren't a fan of low profile boards, then this Halo 65 is going to be for you. This is a 65% layout, so you do have those arrow keys. On the website here, you can choose between two different switches. You can either get the Magnetic Coral for $90 USD or the Magnetic Jade Pro for $100 USD. Now keep in mind the regular price for these is down here. This is the pre-order prices. So if you buy right now during the pre-order, you do get it for $10 cheaper. The pre-sale is going to end on December 5th, 2024. If you guys want an additional 10% off, you guys can use the code Jakey at checkout to get a 10% discount. This video isn't sponsored in any way, but using that link does help support the channel. And Nufi did send out this keyboard for review. So yeah, on the website, you can choose between the two different switches. You can also add a wrist rest here, which they did send out to me for review so I will be checking that out as well and you can also add extra different styles of keycaps they also have the wandering earth 2 keycap set which I actually reviewed on my channel as well a while back this is a partnership with key talk I'll leave that video again in the description below if you want to check it out and they also provide these shine through black keycaps which they also sent out to me as well standout features of this keyboard include 8000 hertz polling rate so you will be getting the fastest response time compared to a 1000 hertz polling rate keyboard you also get your adjustable actuation and rapid trigger as you would expect from a hall effect keyboard as well as support for socd and as you can see here according to their latency tests the halo 65 he ranks very competitively as one of the lowest when it comes to average latency here are the differences between the magnetic coral and the magnetic jade pro switches i'm actually not sure which one they sent me me, but I'll check in a second when I have this fully unboxed. And here are all of the technical specifications of the keyboard as well in case you're curious. So in the box here we get a quick start guide with all of the keyboard shortcuts as you can see. You also of course get the keyboard itself. This is a plastic chassis on the bottom here, but the top faceplate is aluminum. On the bottom you have two kick-up feet with two separate adjustable levels as you can see. And on flat, you just have four rubber feet on each corner. This is what the default keycaps looks like. I actually really like the aesthetic here. These are PBT keycaps. In the box, you also get a straight USB-C cable. Again, with that orange theme. I would have liked to see a braided cable here, as this is fully rubber. And you also have a switch and keycap puller 2-in-1, also color-coded to match the keyboard. And finally, in the box, you get some extra keycaps as well, the command keys for if you're using this on Mac, and also an extra escape key in case you want to swap it out for this logo style instead of the uh, letters on the escape key. And that's about all you get in the box. So on the physical keyboard here, you do have your little LED strip on the top left, and you also have the logo here on the top right of the keyboard. On the top here, you have your switch to toggle between three different modes, whether it's different operating systems, like if you're switching between PC and Mac, or if you just have different gaming profiles, you can also assign those to these three profiles. And of course you have your USB-C port on the top left as well. And as you can see, I was sent the Magnetic Jade Pro switches right there. This is a hot swappable PCB, so you can change out the switches for other Hall Effect switches if you want. And here's the board all plugged in with a default RGB. While we're at it, let's open up the two-tone wrist rest here. This is what the wrist rest looks like right here. As you can see, it's an acrylic material with stainless steel on the bottom. And then on the bottom, you have your rubber feet. You also have extra foot pads in the box as well. As you can see here, the 1.5 millimeters are pre-installed by default. You can also change it to 2 millimeters and 2.5 millimeters, depending on how high you like your wrist rest. So yeah, this is what it looks like right here. You just put your wrist rest and it's pretty much perfect with the keyboard. Let's now go into the software for these Halo 65 HE. Like I said in my Air 60 HE review, I love when companies do web-based software so you don't have to download anything on your computer, which is exactly what this is. Nufi uses a web-based software, which is great because that means you don't have to download anything onto your computer. So it's very straightforward. You can just rebind every single key on this page here. You can change your rapid trigger and actuation point settings very easily. So you just select all. You can set your actuation point. Let me actually update the keyboard first. So yeah, guys, updating the firmware is extremely easy here. 
you just click on update and then you connect it to your keyboard and there we go now the keyboard is updated so like i said very easy to change everything you can rebind all your keys on this first tab on this tab here you can change all of your rapid trigger settings as well as your customizable actuation we're going to turn on rapid trigger i like to set this to the most sensitive on this tab here you can record macros if you want and then you can also change the lighting effects on the keyboard and on the mode settings here, you can change the polling rate as well. I'm just going to leave it on 8000 hertz. So yeah, very straightforward software. Let's now test the performance of the board. First, you already know I love doing the notepad test. And basically, the notepad test is just opening up a notepad here. And I'm just going to feather a key very lightly. I set it to one millimeter and it seems like it's working as intended. And then I'm just going to lift off this key ever so slightly. And yeah, it looks like... It works just like any other Hall Effect keyboard that I've tested in the past. And yeah, I don't really even feel a need to test this inside of the Valorant range because nowadays Hall Effect keyboards are very toe-to-toe -to -toe when it comes to the performance if the Hall Effect is implemented properly. And from what I've seen from the Air 60 HE that I reviewed from Newfie, their Hall Effect is very solid and pretty much on the same level as Wooting. I really have no concerns when it comes to the performance of the board but let's get into the sound test now which i'm sure a lot of you are interested in so my board is running the magnetic jade pros so do keep that in mind for the sound test Alright guys, that was the sound test of the Halo 65 HE. I really like how the Magnetic Jade Pro sound. Really fantastic sounding keyboard, lubed very nicely as well. And yeah, really no complaints from me in the sound department. So yeah guys, that was my review of the Halo 65 HE from Nufi. I really like Nufi's keyboards and I feel like they're priced very fairly as well. The Halo 65 HE with the Magnetic Jade Pro switches is going to be priced at $110 after the pre-sale. Before the pre-sale, you can get it for $99 USD, which I feel like is an extremely good price for a Hall Effect keyboard that performs this well and also sounds this good as well. So yeah, I can highly recommend Nufi products and their keyboards really good performance wise and priced very nicely as well so that's pretty much it guys that was my review of the new fee halo 65 he i hope you guys enjoyed this video and of course if you guys want that 10 percent discount you can use the code jakey at checkout but that's pretty much it guys i will see you guys in the next video peace